one of your long journeys in the sanctuary. Are you, are you well enough to drive? Ooh. This landing, too. Welcome back to Let's Play Mad Max, Running Dog fans. We're here in the jaw. And I uh, bet that guy's wishing he wasn't in the jaw right about now. You know, because he's dead and all. I just wanted to come up here and uh, take care of a stunt jump. Before I headed on to Fuel Veins. Because this is the location of the last Scarecrow and the last Convoy. In uh, Jeet's territory, I should say. I don't know if I'm going to lower the threat to zero in all of the territories. I want to do it for this one because... Hell yeah, maximum uh, harpoon. That's the word I was trying to think of. By the way, when I was uh, getting myself up here... I discovered, since I didn't really interact with them uh, the other times I was here, these ladders are just painted on. You cannot actually go up these towers. Huh. Let's leave this place behind and head up. Well, here, actually. Hey guys, just wanted to insert this since I forgot to uh, record it during the actual episode. And uh, inform you all that uh, if you like this developer, you can get your hands on Just Cause 4 for the low, low price of zero dollars and zero cents at the Epic Games Store from uh, a few days ago, actually, until Thursday the 23rd of April. Unless you were watching this in the future, in which case that is almost certainly not the case. Sorry. But yeah, if you're watching this in the present, go check it out. I haven't actually played that one myself, but Just Cause is generally a pretty rad time, so... Seems like a good idea to me. This is not a sponsored video, I just think free stuff is cool. Pull that guy away and run him over. Nice. Oh my. Because I do remember that. That's a shame. I'm not sure there is a way up there. I might just have to, uh... Blow that up with a rocket from a distance. Oh no, I'm right up your ass. You want to tangle? Now we're tangled. Oh, you're just grinding me, I see. Oh, fine. Now you are extremely dead, and my car is just fine. God, I can't see shit. Alright, alright. Get some distance, get some muscle behind it. We got muscle to spare. That's 
Big Chief. So steep, though. Nice. Take that. And that. Desk. It's a weird thing to find out here. I have a tire on my uh, hood. Oh yeah, from the vehicles I just rammed. Oh, it's around the V8. Oh no. right off the end. And then I suppose we just wait. What in the hell is that? I'm not getting distracted. It's in the same region. Fuck, I'm getting distracted. I thought I was inside of the thing. The uh, convoy route, I mean. Yeah, right? Weird place. And they got their own sniper. Fuck it, let's go say hi. There he is. How do I get in here? Excuse me? Oh shit. Ah, stop that. There! Over there! You're just right here, aren't you? I meant to shoot the guy, as if to indicate that, you know, my rifle is better than your rifle, even if it is a sawed-off shotgun. But, uh... Huh. That's weird. the water thing? No. Does it matter I suddenly realized? Because I hadn't actually drunk any. Even that barely took anything away. <laughs> Yoink! Four snipers on one building. Roadkill guys are nuts. Just FYI, I'm coming to shoot you. being in range of my weapon. Huh? Oh, you don't like it? I mean, next time you should consider that, or fucking taking shots at everyone who comes in range.
What? Oh. I'll just drink away my broken leg. You know, it occurs to me to wonder if there is such a thing in the wasteland as uh, alcohol counter brewing. Like if somebody's trying to find a way to uh, extract the water from alcohol. Sort of looking around for uh, little bins because there's a history relic here. I was kind of uh, preoccupied with trying not to get shot in the face the first time right there. I did see that, but I was, you know, again, dodging and weaving, so. Surely it should be up here. Oh, here we go. There was an area I didn't check out. History relic. It's just a bunch of guns. Dude, we're running out of options here. Alright, uh, fuck this. If you want to get a gun... <clears throat> yeah, fine. You better pull the proverbial trigger, man, or you'll end up paying big bucks for a bunch of rust and dust. Max has nothing cynically insightful to say about the concept of, uh, guns. Oh god. Oh, you had your mouth closed, dude. I suppose he's Australian, and they did their best to fix that problem, so... Damn, that didn't take long. I was about to do a, uh, a jump cut. I was all quiet because I was trying to think of the words for it. So that's what that's about. The, uh, the good people do still try to jump. They just fucking die. Still clinging to the side of the car. I don't know how annoyed you would be if you died in someone else's road war. On the plus side, we dislodged that guy. On the negative side, I dislodged that guy, too. Damn. This is it, you assholes are all that's standing between Jeet's territory and a threat level of zero. I think I hit the door. 
trying to get the tires, but you know, sometimes you just can't. Where have you been? Thank God for these new tools. Literally, if you believe Chum. I'm very glad I did that. Suddenly. I suppose if I'd taken off, I wouldn't have had to worry about them. On behalf of the people of Jeet's territory, I would just like to say, you know, to you on behalf of Scabrous Scrotus, get stuffed. Hmm, I thought that would do it. Cartoon physics say that he should be going much faster now. Bring the oh, man. Yeah, I'll fix her up in the meantime, say. Reloaded the gun, reloaded the car, and just like that, we're back on the road. Hmm. Yes! Let's go with that. No, this is the vehicle of a saint. Oh yes, the harpoon. The massive hook attachment. The ultimate harpoon. What cannot be done with this brutal tool cannot be done at all. The increased power and durability of the massive hook attachment enables the harpoon to pull down massive structures. This has been a long time coming. Do you wish to purchase and install the massive hook attach- or, or, or just purchase and install massive hook attachment for 1,000 scrap? Yes, I do! Oh, yes. Oh, yeah. Shredder rims. When the shredder speaks, the defilers listen. Then they're ground up to shreds of rubber and steel, limb and ligament, and joyous the righteous stands. Triple the amount of grinding damage. Sure! 1800 scrap. Seems like a lot for that, but okay. Jesus. Look at these things! Good lord! Uh, plug Halo. The Plug Halo Skull, the signum of everlasting death birth of machines. Personalize the magnum opus of this boot and gain a defense boost. Teddy also gives me a defense boost, so let me see. Not the rubber baby, that thing freaks me out.
Well, I could use a handling boost. Is there an acceleration boost in any of them? No. No, there is not. There we are. Now, if you'll excuse me. <laughs> yeah, let's make the dump safe. any different? I cannot tell. Yes, I can, if I do this. Damn it. Huh. Tell you what, screen grab. And there's your thumbnail. Oh, right. This stuff is always between point A and point B. Scrotus is going to be so angry about all this that he's just going to drop dead of an aneurysm and I'm not going to have to fight him. Yeah, right. Well, the important thing is I've just uh, redeemed about a busload of people whose remains are used to make that fucking thing. Can I steal this? This might fool them. Nope. And it doesn't uh, fool them. It doesn't say anything about being undetected by, like, the Scrotus faction or the Legion faction or whatever. The important thing is that this will do it for another episode of Let's Play Mad Max. Aw, oh, jeez. Aw, oh, jeez. I'm Burning Dog Face, and I will see you next time when we, uh... suppose now would be a good time to, uh... Oh. There was one valve left. My bad. Well, let's do that! And then I guess we can, uh... Try and help Glory. I prefer not to beat the game until I get all the camps, but I suppose, worst case scenario, I can clean them up afterwards. You know, just in case this does lead to the end game. I've got all the equipment I think I could ever need. Good God. Later.